Videograms Indoor light painting A simple guide on how to achieve simple images like these Some of the basics you will require for making physiograms. One, a camera. Personally, I use a wide angle lens. Two, a cable release with a lock open. So you can have the camera on bulb mode open for an indefinite period of time. A piece of string, variable lengths. I've added weight onto the end of here. I've put a little clip hook on the end for changing the LED light sources easily and a clip onto the end so I can attach it to the ceiling. Several different LED light sources all creating different effects when turned on and left on. An LED wand has seven different settings all when used with physiograms with long exposure create different effects. Small torch, the end has been narrowed down to a small dot. Simple garden ornament light, tops removed, once the lights turned on the solar panel no longer registers anything. On and off light will come on straight away. This one's got a colour and a white light option. Modified slightly so it'll hang down nice and easily every time. For longer, more complex physiograms, a simple piece of card. In this case, I've used a piece of black card I had lying around. Perfect, doesn't let any light through into the camera. Firstly, you will need to attach the line to a secure high point with nothing around it. Personally, I attach it to a lampshade. Do this gently and carefully so you don't damage anything. Next, position your camera centrally beneath the LED at the end of your piece of string. Now, making sure the end of the LED is roughly between 6 and 12 inches away from the end of the lens. Turn the LED on making sure you have every focal point on the camera turned off. Then turn off the lights, half press the shutter until you hear the camera has focused. Next put the lens onto manual mode. You have now focused on the LED light source. Now turn off the lights. With the lights turned off, you are now ready to start swinging the pendulum. Pull back and gently release, pushing gently to the side in a nice ecliptic angle. Once the wobble of the initial swing has eased out, start your camera. You can now leave it turned on until you are happy. You are now ready to start your physiograms. Gently pull back on your pendulum, the LED turned on, and release with a gentle push to the side. Once the initial wobble of the string has abated, start your camera. You can now leave the camera turned on until you are happy you have got a decent image. As you can see, the LED light is moving around from different angles. The camera is now recording these as lines against the black background. I recommend trying this several times until you're happy with the basics of starting and stopping of the camera and watching the pendulum motions. Once you have got used to it, you can then go into longer and more complex photographs. I recommend trying this a few times to begin with until you are happy with the basic start and stop 
of the pendulum motion. Once you are happy with this, you can then go into more complex physiograms. An average physiogram can be between 30 seconds and 4 to 5 minutes long. But once you get more involved in it, they can end up being 7 or 12 minute exposures. You can do this by, once the pendulum motion has stopped moving, taking a piece of black card. Once you are happy with the basic exposure you've got from the first light, leaving the camera turned on, place the piece of card over the lens. The camera is still running, but no longer recording an image. What you can now do, take off the current light, turning it off, placing a new light source over the camera, start this pendulum motion going, and once the wobble has gone, and at a prearranged or decided point, remove the card, you are now recording light again in the camera, without any unwanted lines for editing. This helps you create longer, more complex physiograms.